What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in to yet another video. I am your host, That Dragon Guy, and today we're going to be talking about my balls. We'll get to that in a minute. But first, let's say hello to Tomiki, my buddy, who I woke up from a nap just so I could get him on camera. He's all tired and shit, doesn't want to be on camera, just wants to go back to sleep. <laughs> He'll wake up in about an hour and run around like crazy and want to go outside and, uh, you know, play fetch and whatnot. He's really good. He listens very, very well. Tomiki is a great little dog. <laughs> yes, he is. He's getting so big, though. He is so heavy. Uh, won't be too much longer and I won't be able to hold him in my lap. Hey, that right, buddy. I'm Tomiki. All right, let's hold you up to the camera one more time. You say bye. Bye to everybody. Bye. Yeah. Oh. He loves me. <laughs> All right, Tommy okay. All right. So, the title of this video is not clickbait. We are going to be talking about my balls, but not the kind of balls that you're probably thinking about. A um, couple days ago, uh, I think it was, what, day four yesterday? I posted a video of me playing The Sims 4, and uh, Dragonheart went on a date with Caitlyn, and they went bowling, and blah, 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 and I started talking about League, and how League uh, works, how you switch lanes in between each frame. The reason why I know about League is because I used to bowl in a bowling league when I was a little bit younger, uh, well... A lot a bit younger. <laughs> I haven't really bowled in league since the uh, accident happened. Um, anyway, today we're going to talk about that. When I was younger, I wanted to become a pro bowler. I absolutely love bowling. I knew all about the oil patterns. I know how to hook my balls. I blah, blah, blah. <laughs> my average was uh, 199 for about two years. But the thing is, in order to become pro, you have to have an average of 200 for two years. No matter how hard I tried, I just couldn't do that last point. So, as I said, we're going to be talking about my balls. So, before we pull out the balls, or the bowling balls, uh, I wasn't in this champions or anything. It's just a cool towel I picked up while I was bowling. I had a friend who was on my uh, league team who went to this event or whatever, and he knew I liked dragons, so he let me have this. It was cool. <laughs> anyway, on to my balls. First off, you got your nice little wrist guard thing to uh, help you hook the ball or just help you not sprain your wrist while doing it because it's... You know, you got to flick your wrist in order to hook the ball and whatnot. Let's start off with uh, my favorite ball. And I do believe, I need to clean my balls. But uh, I do believe this is the last one they made because they stopped doing these kind of the uh, this particular ball. And this is the Black Widow Venom. Yeah, it looks cool, doesn't it? This ball is 16 pounds. It's a little bit dirty. It needs to be cleaned. I haven't bowled in years. And I kind of want to go back to it. But I used to bowl a lot. If you can't tell, there's nicks in my ball from the ball return and whatnot. So yeah, th this ball is really old. Uh, another ball that I have is... Um, oh wait, well, let me keep talking about that one. That one's the uh, Black Widow Venom. And I believe it was the last Black Widow they released. I can't exactly remember. I just know I pre-ordered that ball. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, Black Widow has always been my favorite balls. And that's because when I first started bowling in the league, I had a teammate. Uh, I didn't actually have any balls of my own when I first started uh, you know, bowling league. I uh, was just learning how to hook. Um, so I used house balls. House balls are really hard to hook, so I had a teammate who let me use his bowling balls, and, uh, well, one of his bowling balls that he let me use was a Black Widow. It was a Black Widow hammer. 
and I fell in love with the way that it hooked. Not only was my normal hook really, really strong with that ball, um, my reverse hook, which reverse hook, if you don't know, uh, is when a right-handed bowler can do a left-handed hook, which means I can throw the ball and make it uh, hook the opposite way that I would normally be able to make it hook with my right hand. And he, it, it would hook and get that 10 pin, no problem. This ball hooked really well. So after I used that ball, I decided my very first ball and the only ball that I ever ended up buying was the Black Widow Venom. And matter of fact, that same friend let me buy his ball from him. And that is this ball right here. We have the Black Widow Hammer. Yeah, where's the hammer at? It's here somewhere. It actually says hammer. Aha. Well, it's probably just a regular Black Widow. I think Hammer is the name of the company that makes it. I could be wrong. I don't know. But either way, it's the Black Widow. And this is the very first Black Widow I ever used. And it was amazing. And I loved it. And, uh, yeah, I really want to go back to Bowling League. Ugh. And seeing how far I can get with it. I used to be good. I haven't bowled in years. Maybe I'll do a video in a uh, few weeks, a few days, a few weeks. I don't know how long it'll take me. But maybe I'll do a video of me at the bowling alley. Uh, and maybe I'll do another video explaining why I don't know when that'll happen. Yeah. Anyway, if you liked watching today's video of me talking about League. Oh, before I go, I have a story. Um... I don't know if I can find the picture. I doubt I'll be able to find the picture because uh, it happened when I was so young, and I had it on a, had the picture on an old phone that I uploaded the picture to an old Facebook that I don't use anymore, and my score was like two fifty seven, I think. Uh, but that game was a. Uh, Frames 1 through 9, I got nothing but strikes. Nothing but strikes. 10th frame. First thing, strike. Second go. Only knocked down uh, 7 or 8 pins. I can't exactly remember. Uh, point is, I did that entire game with 10 strikes and a spare. Which, in order to get a perfect game, you need 13 strikes. Or no, 12 strikes sorry 10th frame is one strike and then two more strikes it's 12 not 13 i don't know why i said 13 point is in order to get a perfect game you need 12 strikes and i was two strikes off because i messed up in the 10th frame i believe my score ended up being 257 256 i don't know but the picture clearly shows one through ten nothing but strikes until i got that spare in the second go on the 10th frame Yep. And for those of you that don't know, in the 10th frame, you can get up to uh, two or three strikes. Um, you strike and then spare, or you can strike, strike. Uh, point is, you can go up to three times in the 10th frame. Yep. It's been so long since I bowled. I need to go back to it. Like I said, I may do a video where I go bowling and show you me bowling an entire game. Not what I do in between frames, but show you frame 1 through 10 and show you my final score in one of the videos. Yeah, I might. We'll have to see. Uh, but before then, I'll probably do a video explaining why I don't know if I'm going to do that. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget about my dog's uh, Instagram account, which is at Yumi and Tomiki. Uh, don't forget about my Twitter. You can follow me on there at that dragon guy. Um... Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell because I post every single day and you surely want to be notified. All that being said, I have been your host talking about his balls, that dragon guy. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye! <laughs> Peace out, guys.